So I call this the tug of war. In the center of the circle right here, that there's nothing there, there is the tug of war. War means confusion. War is also the word for, again, just rehashing. We also know that this is chaos. Um, it's also a maze. Um, it's, it hasn't been rendered clear. It's empty. It hasn't been filled yet. This is our mind. We're looking down at our brain. And it's kind of the shadow work that we're resolving through our light work by going the righteous path of mother that tells us, yeah, you're going to weave this and we're going to release the shadow one increment at a time as you journey this so you comprehend this. So this is the tug of war, maintaining center. And if if war and peace were, have a, were to have a love child, it would be called fierce love. And that's what I'm saying, that this is family. And that's why I guard this with my, with my life. It's a treasure to me to extrapolate out the fierceness of what love is, because it had to journey through the wages of war to receive the inheritance of peace. In that, fierce love guards the journey. It's a gatekeeper, it's a door, it's a potential seen through the lenses of yod heh shin vat heh So I'll read this. So to know the intention is opportunity to fulfill the purpose of intent. A weaving journey that masterly forms the centered stand of awareness. A balanced destination of between that has gently emptied out and the ingathered torrent of sovereignty's compression. A generous outpouring that unwinds the wound and raises servanthood's head. That's what's happening right now. 